Get out of my face, I'm Kenny Kennedy, and sitting beside me here is the very cruel Doc Brooks, who's made me sad by not being here. I hate you, Doc. I don't get it, Kenny. If you hate me, why do you want me here? Don't make me explain feelings to you, Doc. You're better than me at dealing with them, and it makes me feel inferior. Ha! You just said a feeling. I love you, Doc! Now bring your face in toward mine. It's time for the face crash. All right, first up, British authorities are cracking down on the underground world of night Olympics. Olympians shouldn't compete in unsanctioned pitch dark environments. Ryan Lochte crashed blindly into a pool wall last night and no one can tell if he had a concussion because he always talks like that. Athletes know the purest Russian sports comes in the terror of night's black void when competition is only touch, scent, and sound. I'm an eyeball man. If I can't see an event, it didn't happen. You see the 10 trash can lids hanging on the winner's necks and Day, Doc. And you see Christian Parr's world record hammer throw distance spray painted on the wall. The distance between the sound of a rattling chain and the screaming of a cat will never be official. Cats die, no one cries. Back in day Olympics, London weather forced shot putters to wear long sleeves, depriving forearm fans of a prime chance to ogle their wrist hand. Four fans deserve better. They appreciate that hand bone as a living heirloom from the times of Mountain Man. Don't pull a tear string yet. Us necophiles we're plenty pleased with this year's shot put. No turtlenecks like an 88. Sophisticate your muscle palate. Head stems are only good for sneeze support. Oh. You need four arms when you're rolling out a hot pizza back in the dough shape. That's not how you eat a pizza, Doc. Maybe with your wrist, real men wring out the sauce and the cheese into a bowl, dip that dough, and chew. Chew on this, Doc. Over in London's run arena, Usain Bolt achieved an historic triumph, sprinting to gold in front of probable virulent races Queen Elizabeth II. It's one thing to reestablish yourself as the fastest man in the world. Yeah. It's another to show up a royal who's presumably one of the modern era's great bigots. Bolt rebuffed a privileged monarch whose contempt for the formerly colonized Jamaicans is likely even worse than her all but certain hatred of Irish, Scots, and lowborn English. She'll stay set in her ways. Her father, King George VI, probably taught her some very racist lessons that she never forgot. She's not an elephant, Doc. All right, let's end the face crash before we forget. Marty, show us the medal count. Oh, God damn it, Marty. How can Doc be winning? Gold is still gold, Kenny. Even if the medals you gave me were for abandonment sloth and pen stealing, oh. plus Marty dunks you a gold every time you threaten to kill him. Only I give it a take it away. I am going to kill you, Marty. One last oh bit of God damn it. One last bit did it. You're one last bit of Run, Marty. Run like your life is depending on it. <laughs>